two million dollars. Two? Yes, one for me, or one for you. There's a lot of good old ladies out there. Step four, we hired the worst actors in New York. Head open on Broadway, and we can say step five, we close on Broadway. Take our two million and go to Rio. Rio? Oh, it'll never work. Oh, ye have little faith. We wanted to say to Clark, when everything looked bleak. We wanted surrender and say to Tenzing as they struggled up Everest Peak. We wanted Washington say his troops as they crossed the Delaware. I'm sure you're well aware. What they say? We can do it. We can do it. We can do it, me and you. We can do it. Everything you've ever wanted is just waiting to be had. Beautiful girls wearing nothing but pearls, caressing you, undressing you, and driving you mad. We can do it. We can do it. This is not the time to smirk. We can do it. You won't ruin it. Say goodbye to Penny Clark. Hi, producer. Yes, producer. I mean you, sir, go berserk. We can do it, we can do it, and I know it's gonna work. What do you say? What do I say? Finally a chance to be a Broadway producer. What do I say? Finally a chance to make my dreams come true, sir. What do I say? What do I say? Here's what I say to you, sir. I can't do it. I can't. Chasing me, embracing me, I have an attack. Why, you measured me, literally little caterpillar. Don't you want to become a butterfly? Don't you want to spread your wings and flap your way to glory?
days of the opera popular are numbered. Christine Dyer will be singing on your behalf tonight. Be prepared for a great misfortune should you attempt to take her place. Far too many letters for my taste. And all about Christine. All that we've heard since we've came is about Miss Dyer's name. <clears throat> Miss Dyer has returned. I have no words for us. I thought it best she'd be alone. She needed rest. May I see her? No, monsieur. She will see no one. Will she sing? Here. I have a note. Let me see it. Please. Gentlemen, I have now sent you several notes of the most amiable nature, detailing how my theater is to be run. You have not followed my instructions. I shall give you one last chance. Christine Dye has returned to you, and I am anxious her career should progress. In the new production of Il Muto, you would therefore cast Carlotta as the page boy and put Miss Dye in the role of Countess. The role which Miss Dye plays calls for charm and appeal. The role of the page boy is silent, which makes my casting, in a word, ideal. <laughs> I shall watch the performance from my normal seat in box five, which will be kept empty for me. Should these commands be ignored, a disaster beyond your imagination will occur. I remain, gentlemen, your obedient servant. O.G. But this is absurd. Surely you won't let Christine play the role. Castle the opera. Monsieur Raoul, what can we do? This fellow will start violence. And the opera cannot fail to open its new work. Impossible! It ruined us, Monsieur! Monsieur Le Comte, the ghost does not idly threaten. Best to give him what he wants. But, Mama, Christine, is she in danger? I'm not afraid of this ghost. He's flesh and blood. He'll not stand up to my stick. Okay, that is enough! Do not tell him the business of your confessors. There is not danger without you smashing about. I must agree with Monsieur Andre. That course of action is dangerous. Well, I will not stand for it. I will play the lead, or I will not play at all. But shut up, La Volonta. Please be reasonable. <laughs> Il Muto must go for this plan. With the changes our friend has described, of course. Bouquet ready the scenery. Madame Jerry, notify the ballet. All right, everybody. Four hours of today, much to do. Monsieur Andre, I can't allow this. Allow, Monsieur, allow. I do not believe you are in a position. Be rational. <laughs> With our friend watching every move we make, we do not have much of a choice. We'll see about this. I'll go to Christine. I'll take her away. You'll see. Oh, is everyone mad? What are you waiting for? We have an offer to produce. All right, places, everybody, for God's sake. 